numbers through the years and you see reflected the global reach of the game. It's been awarded since 1956, and in the first 63 years, only three players born outside the United States had claimed it. Akeem Olajuwon, Steve Nash, and Dirk Nowitzki. But the last five years, the honor has gone to players who learn the game and develop their love for it in their homelands, Greece, Serbia, Cameroon. That global impact will be evidenced again in 2024 with Canada, Slovenia, and Serbia represented. Here are the finalists for Kia NBA Most Valuable Player. Luka Doncic of the Dallas Mavericks. Wow. Nikola Jokic of the Denver Nuggets. And Oklahoma City's Shea Gilgis Alexander. Mm -hmm. Got two MVPs here. This, is, this guy is closest. But you passed up a charity golf tournament today in Alabama and wanted to be here, and you're wearing a new suit, so you get to wanted do the Wanted to be here. supposed to be here. <laughs> it works. He didn't want to be late. Okay. I appreciate it, Ernest. Next time, big fella. I'm not going to look. I want to just wait until he hears it. The 2024 MVP from the Denver Nuggets, mm. Nikola Jokic. And we congratulate the Joker, who for the third time is the Kia MVP of the NBA. 26 points a game was number 10 in the league. 12 rebounds was number four. Nine assists was number three. Had 25 triple doubles, second most in the league. 68 double doubles was second in the league. 31 games of at least 10 assists this year. 23 games with at least 15 rebounds. And Nikola Jokic claims his third MVP award. Shaq, your thoughts? Yeah, guys, let's hear Shaq, how he's going to talk about this year MVP, Nikola Jokic, and let's see how he's going to make it all about Shaq, how he's been robbed a few times when he was winning, but this is the regular season MVP Shaq. You got to understand this. Regular season, most valuable player. And let's see what Shaq is going to have to say. I don't like to rain on people's parade, but I'm not happy with this one. Congratulations to Joker. You're the best bad, big man in the league, but based on everybody's criteria, my criteria, stats, stat stuffer, you guys' criteria, number one seed, which team has a better record, I felt Shea Alexander deserved it because I've been, I've been number two a lot when I played my ass off number two. So the fact that he has to start all over next year and try to win it again, I, I, I think it was, I, I, I know it's going to be hurtful for him. Hopefully he uses this to motivate him to win a championship. But I thought, and again, no disrespect to the Joker, best big man in the league by far. Uh, you could have went this way, but I, I thought Shea Gilgis Alexander, one of only you know a few players that had 30 points 50 times, stat stuffer, great season. His team is number one. Nobody expected him to be number one. I thought Shea Gilgis Alexander was going to win it by far. But it's congratulations great. to Joker. I'm happy for him. Third time MVP. You really can't be mad at this vote, but no, the can't. fact that he has to start all over next year and, and, and win it over again, because again, I, I felt I was robbed two or three times, right? And I played my ass off. Stat stuffer, won championships but, those years, but again, no but disrespect you, to Joker, but I, I, me personally, I would have gave it to Shea. You keep throwing stat stuffer out there. Does no, because that's Nicole, my criteria for does MVP. Does Jokic not stuff the stat sheet? Yeah, but not like a, no, but not no, like no, a, I mean Shea when. Really? Shea is one of the few players that had 30 points in 50 games, yeah, Ernie. Well, like, look at, but when you're talking and, about stuff in the stat sheet, and, look, at, look at all the triple doubles for Nikola Jokic. Look yeah, at his ranks but, in scoring, rebounding, okay, and assists. I don't he, think stat even, stuffing is, a, is an argument. Okay, here. but even doing all that. OKC was the number one. They had the, they had, only they had, by one game. No, Jack. they had no. They had identical That's records. Right. Oh, okay. It was a it was a division record tiebreaker. Well, that was uh, the separating listen, factor. All this is, is subjective. Man. Yeah, it is. Well, so, and you're and you're, you're certainly entitled to. Exactly. You can make a case for.
any of those well, three to make it. And in well, addition, I thought a few you could, other ones. Actually, I thought you could have made. I, and I've said it before, and I just said I thought you could have made a case for five guys. Sure, without question. Anthony Edwards and Jalen Brunson. I thought anybody voted for one of those five, I would have been like, okay, I can understand that because every year. Idiots get on TV and talk about who's the best player. It never goes to the best player. It goes who had the best regular season. You know, Shaq said he got robbed. Not every year it doesn't. Well, most of the time. It goes to the guy. Yeah. So, you know, Shaq said he got robbed. I don't know if he got robbed. I got robbed. Right, that was the baddest Steve, mofo yeah, in the but it, 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 Let's it, talk it, about it, now. It, it doesn't though. go to the best player. It goes to the guy who had the best regular well, you season. you know what? Don't name the most valuable player then. Uh, no. well, well, don't name the most valuable subject. player then. Well, it goes to the most valuable player in the league. It, that was me. It does most not. Most valuable it player in the league. That's Shea Gilgis Alexander. Okay, let's, well, well, don't name it that then. Let's, well, let's stick it's to Don't name it that It's subjective. Let's stick to this year. Let me give you the results, by the way, because it really wasn't close. Woo. First First, now that's surprising. First place votes, 79 for Joker, 15 for SGA, 4 for Luca, 1 for Giannis. None for Bronson? No. Total votes, total points, 926 for Joker, 640 for SGA, 566 for Luca. So it's well, Joker, SGA, and Luka Doncic, 1, 2, 3. I mean, 15 for SGA, come on. I, I just, I would say this, you know, Jokic is arguably the best center in this millennial right now. There's, there's no question that he is. He's the one of third MVP. Um. Here as you get guys see what is Shaq. He can make a case. Shaq is all about him, man. He's a selfish dude that he thinks about himself. I don't know why. He's, he's such a nice guy off in real life. But I, I, when it comes to basketball, he's so selfish. It's all about him. He can never make a case. First he was saying... Alexander, he got the better stats than Jokic and stuff. Kenny told him, explained him. That's not true. Then he moves on saying that how OKC had a better record than the Nuggets. Then it was a tiebreaker. They had a, uh, the same uh, amount of wins. So Shaq, you got to get your stuff correctly right because you can never make a case. Even when you make a case, when you were arguing with Chuck, and Kenny, about filling your gas tank half. Every time it hits half, you fill it up so you save money. It doesn't work like that, Shaq. You, you're a smart guy, man. I don't know how you make all your money. But you got to get your facts. Write it down on a piece of paper before you speak and open your big mouth. So don't be a hater for Joker. Actually, Joker should have won even last year. She should have won three MVPs in a row. Okay? Thank you, Chuck, for being always real and honest and speak the way it is. You just speak how it is. Don't take sides. And I, I respect that. Shaq, you're wrong, brother. You're wrong. Kenny, thank you. Um, I love the show, but Shaq, you're just being a hater right now. You were like just uh, Perkins when he was hating last year. He was promoting Embiid, Embiid, Embiid. Embiid can never even pass a first round uh, of playoffs. And you can't tell me he's a he's an MVP winner. Okay, regular season. Okay, that was regular season. I take that back. Regular season. Okay. So Shaq, you're wrong. And I'll get back to you guys now. There's another game right now, Indy and New York Knicks. Let's make another video. Follow, like, comment, and let me know what you think about Joker, his third MVP in four years. And let's hope for them to come back in this series against Minnesota. All right, thank you.